What's up, Internet? Oh, I got the size of this all wrong. You have no idea, as I fix this, the rigmarole I just went through to even be able to stream this. Because, fun story, nothing wanted to work. <laughs> um, I had to reinitialize all my equipment. And then I had to go through, restart my computer, which didn't want to actually restart. And then I had to basically just force shut down, go crazy with it, and then try and get everything back to work. All while being really sick and losing my voice. So this is, uh, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. But uh, here we are in the town. Dogs barking outside, that's tremendous. Let's take a look at our presents to see what we have from our old pal, Mr. Museum. Because Mr. Museum, Always has some good stuff for us, usually, when it's not a tiny little paperweight. Now oh, we got a Triceratail. Awesome. Dinosaur track, that's paperweight. And another paperweight. So, again, not the best start to whatever we're doing today. But, all the same, we do the best we can with what we have. And we're gonna go to our old pal, Mr. Nooks and try and sell some stuff. And we will, in fact, carouse as I remember that my door is wide open and sounds going to be even worse now. Ah, great day all around. Uh, but uh, let's sell this stuff. Yes. Nope, that's it. Thanks, Mr. Nook. Alright, let's see what we've so got upstairs. Now we got a bonsai. Pineapple bed. I do like the pineapple bed, but I don't think we need it. As much as I really just kind of want it. But of course, we always have the good old classic flowers to go by. Which, if nothing else, makes the town better for everyone. So let's uh, let's work on making the town a better place as we do every day we possibly can. All right, I will take that, and we will go in and take these tulips. No, no, I in fact want those tulips. Steal or no, those tulips are now mine. And I'll take these tulips as well because we need all the tulips we can get. Hooray! Alright, so now we've got our flowers, let's go plant them. Do we have any new villagers today? I'm not seeing any. No. We really need to get some new villagers in here. Or at least some older villagers. Seriously, I want Pierce back so bad. Alright, uh, I don't think we can plant one there, but we can plant one here, so let's do that. Plant one here. Plant that there. Plant that there. And plant that there, because I guess we didn't finish that row. And hey, it's our old pal Spike, who's still rocking the awesome Isaac shirt. And he's got something for us to do. Uh-oh. No, I didn't say that I was going to go get it from Ellie. She's always asleep. And because of that, I can't possibly get it from her. I'm sorry, Spike. But unfortunately, that is just an unfortunate fact of life, and I'm sure Suey's probably going to just tell me to go get the organizer again, but we just can't. Because the person we're dealing with is always asleep. Alright, I'll go get a kerchief from our old pal Tangy. The bizarre fruit cat of fruit catliness. Alright, so Tangy is half She's not uh, left her house on the other side of the river, so let's go deal with that. Ooh. Yes, please. I'll take a fossil. And we are going to slowly make our way to Tangy. 
Well, maybe we'll spare some vitamin C for us so I can feel better. I want your kerchief and perhaps some vitamin C. Ugh, Ellie. Ellie ruins everything. Alright, well, I'm gonna go catch this fish. Maybe that'll help me feel better. Catfish. That catfish isn't gonna help me feel better. Alas, maybe Pearl's got something for us. That would make my day to do something for Pearl, provided it doesn't have to go through any of the stupid villagers who are already asleep, which is like half of them at this point. Pearl! Do you need help? I do like gardening, but unfortunately, I can't do anything about your particular house for a while yet, I'm afraid, my friend. Let's see if there's any events going on. Is there anything special coming out soon, Copper? No. Uh, peaceful, but peaceful's boring. Peaceful doesn't give me a lot to look forward to. Uh, Booker, you're not giving me much to keep interested in. Uh, Alright, well, let's go see if maybe our good friend Gulliver has graced us with his majestic appearance today. Who knows, maybe he has. Got this, we'll just pull that and get out of there. Uh, nothing around here. Nope. Fish. That's a little tiny baby fish. I want the baby fish. Baby fish powers catch and go. Goldfish. I'm going for some goldfish crackers right about now. Those are great when you're sick. Although I would have preferred to have caught a pop-eyed goldfish because I still need one of those for the museum. There's another fossil. I have to buy some paper from Nook. Maybe Rhoda's got something for us. Let's find out. Rhoda, with your creepy animal skins. Do you need something? I know Oxford. I'll go talk to him for you. Consider it done. Alright. So, let's go find Oxy. Right after, we go look for our friend, Gulliver. And now that I've started playing Pokemon Ruby yet again, I want to keep calling him Wingull or Pelipper. Even though I know that's not him. That would make him slightly more useful. Oh, the town is livable. Good. It's good you can live in the town. According to a tree. But where is Oxford? I think I saw him around here. At one point. He's gotta be somewhere. Of course, this is a good excuse as to why the other animals haven't gotten their stuff back. You know, they just can't find the other person. I don't know. It's an excuse. It's maybe not a good one, but still. Oh man, when I'm done this, I think I'm gonna make myself some soup. I'm kind of excited about that now. Grab some chicken soup, maybe some hot chocolate. Be nice. Oh, I think I saw someone. There he is. Hey, Oxy. Don't tell me you gave it to 
Okay, I can deal with you giving things to Pearl. I'm not gonna dig up that glowing spot just because I'm afraid I would miss and whip the flowers. I don't want to do that with my shovel. That would be bad news. Let's... Oh, that's just a normal fish for a second. I thought I saw the super fish. But we did not find the super fish that day. Yay and verily, we passed it up. Or a standard fish that no one wanted. Well, I would like some things, but also a comic book. Cube. Alright, I'll go deal with Cube then. Alright, so Cube is uh, near Nooks, where we can go get some paper for our fossils. So we'll go do that. Should be just a little further. All the way up here. Robot gyroid dance party, woo! I've done better already. I just need a comic book, Mr. Cube. Cookie. Classic cookie. Alright, well, let's go find Cookie then. I believe she's by the wishing well. Which at the very least means that she's easy to find. Easy-ish to find. There she is. I'm gonna get eaten by mosquitoes. I need a comic book. Alright, let's get this to Rhoda. I'm gonna get eaten by a mosquito. Awesome. She looked so happy and wistful when she was looking at the sky when I got bit by a mosquito. She's mean. Rhoda. I have you and your rainbow tail feathers a comic book. I do, but I'll take yours, and then probably sell it. Because at the very least, then I can do some stuff with it, I guess, maybe. I don't know. Let's go to Nooks, get that paper before he closes. It's been about seven minutes. We must act quickly if we are to succeed. but not so quick as to destroy all the flowers in our haste. Mr. Nook, I have a carpet for sale. And a fish. And another fish. And a piece of paper. I'll trade them all for those bells and one stack of papers. So that I can write letters to our old bestest pal museum. Wow, the museum paper, that'll be perfect for them. Alright. Alright. I'm going to go write some letters to our pal, Mr. Museum. Alright, so we're gonna take this write a letter to the museum. Love me. Take this and plop this here. Take this and plop this over here. And we'll slowly inch our way through the flowers so as not to disturb them. Try to avoid getting eaten by the tiny little terror that is the mosquito. Now we can run full blast. Oh. I wanted to catch that fish. Oh. Let's get rid of this. Nice 
thing about going to the post office is we get to see our best friend Phyllis, who always makes us feel better. I've got some letters to mail, Phyllis. One more. I think that's it. Okay. It's good seeing you, Phyllis. Get rid of that. And there doesn't really appear to be much going on right now in the town. And because I'm not feeling too hot, I'll probably just call it here. But uh, it was a bit short today, but I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, pull the stream to know when we go live, because we do this every day to varying lengths, usually longer than this, but uh, recently due to technical difficulties and illness and other stuff, I've just not had the ability to. But hopefully that will change in a day or two when I'm over this. You also want to check out and subscribe to my YouTube channel to see over a thousand videos waiting just for you, and not just Animal Crossing, but any sort of genre of game you can think of. I've probably got something for you. If you really want to make my day, check out the show's PayPal or Patreon. Support the show you any way you can so that I can continue to do the best to my ability of what I do. Plus, get yourself on the Discord where we can talk about awesome things like finding comic books for people, getting annoyed at other villagers for going to bed too early, and how fun losing your voice is, and also all of your equipment kind of at the same time stopping work. That's uh, tons of fun. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Peace out, Internet.